Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Blank to Bank Fishing. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Sonic Gizmo Lite bobbins. So the Sonic Light bobbins come in a small piece of plastic packaging and you will immediately notice there is no kind of case to keep these in um, so you have to kind of either make some space in your current bite alarm setup or place them in something else that you already have. Now when you open them up you're basically presented with the actual bobbin itself, the metal chain comes with it and that's your point to put on your rod pod or rod rest there with a nice little logo um, on it. Now it certainly does feel for the, for the price they are, I mean generally you're looking at spending somewhere between 12 to 15 pounds um, on each of these. Um, they do feel quite good quality I must admit. Um, it, it's like a black finish um, all over with the, obviously the Sonic logo there and they adjust just by being unscrewed um, there. Um, luckily where they screw up both ends it means you can adjust it if you're a bit of a person where you like it presented absolutely perfect looking picture perfect because we like a good picture you can make sure you get your gizmo lined up with with these there and they that just unscrews like so. Um, now with these sorts of uh, items the only way you can really test them is on the bank so we are going to go and do that shortly um, what I would say is they do come with an additional what they call opti curve which is basically an additional uh, 10 gram weight um, and that can just screw in um, like so um, or a shorter bobbin should you need it on the packets um, it does mention that you've basically got your your long and short chain so one is 100 millimeters and the other is 180 millimeters so one's 100 one's 180 millimeters um, so you've got different kind of sizes on there and you've got additional weights um, that you can put in there according um, to it which so it gets supplied with an additional 10 gram um, weight which I, I think is actually in the bottom part there. So these Sonic Gizmo lights weights do come in a variety of colours. I have chosen the blue colour here but you can also get it in green, red, yellow and purple I believe. Um, I found it quite difficult to choose which colour to go for if I'm honest. I was very very tempted by the green however I figured having a bit of history for losing bobbins I figured the green in what's predominantly grass where I fish uh, I realise I will probably end up losing it like usual which is why I went for the blue. Um, I was tempted by the red as well. Let's go and test these out on the bank and see how they do. So here you can see the Sonic Gizmo Lights bobbin in action. So normally you would have that underneath your actual bite arm but doesn't fit on these snag ears which is why it's like that but it still works with that one. And this is on the shorter chain. Having used these now for about eight months I'm very impressed with them. Never had problems with them getting stuck on the line or anything like that. The weight is decent as well, you can see it's holding it. 
quite nicely. This is the blue colour that I have, uh, not the purple, just in case it looks that way on the camera. So overall I recommend the Sonic Gizmo Light Bobbins. They are hard wearing, I've had it for a while and not had any issues and it still pretty much looks as good as new. Thank you for watching my review of the Sonic Gizmo Light Bobbins. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my channel.